Welcome back to Tego Cyber's channel, everybody. We're sitting here again with Shannon. We want to dive into another cybersecurity industry video today. But first off, Shannon, how are you doing? I'm good, Michael. How about yourself? I'm doing pretty well. So Shannon, tell me about printers. So that's an interesting topic of late, uh, especially for those in the cybersecurity world. So um, it came out a few weeks ago about some vulnerabilities in Microsoft Windows printer spooler, and it was dubbed Print Nightmare, and it's a bunch of vulnerabilities that allowed privilege escalation and a bunch of other things to happen through the ability to print on Windows machines. So before the patch was available, when Microsoft basically said, hey, disable printing um, anywhere that has printing capabilities, which wasn't really an option for a lot of enterprises. So Microsoft rushed out an update. It kind of fixed the problem. And then last week they issued another update, which would hopefully fix the problem. But right when they were issuing that second update for Print Nightmare, they actually came out with another disclosure about another vulnerability not related to Print Nightmare that could allow privilege escalation within enterprises. And we're waiting on a patch for that now. But then today, HP came out and basically said, hey, we've had a vulnerability in our printers for the past 15 years. If you have an HP printer from 2005 and on, then you need to patch the firmware on your printers to disclose this vulnerability. So printers uh, much needed for a lot of businesses and right now existing with a lot of vulnerabilities. Yeah, pr printers always have some sort of issues, and this is this is a relatively big one. Aside from them jamming or not connecting or so on, all the things that everybody is familiar with, they also apparently allow this. Um, tell me about this privilege escalation. Explain that to people a little bit. Right. So privilege escalation is kind of a second step after compromise that attackers can use once they're inside an enterprise to essentially elevate their privileges from, let's say, standard user up to administrator. And once they do this privilege escalation, it basically allows them to do whatever they want within the enterprise through this vulnerability that allows them to elevate their permissions. Wow. So it, it is a major part of the attack framework. Um, and it's a thing that we need to be very aware of because it allows a lot of damage to be done. Well, hopefully they can patch all these security risks and leaks uh, quickly. And maybe printers will build up a positive PR in the future. We'll see. <laughs> we hope so, right? <laughs> All right, Shannon. Well, thank you for coming on. Thank you for talking about this again. If anyone has any questions, don't be afraid to send them over. We'll be happy to answer anything you guys got. Shannon, have a wonderful day. Thanks, Michael. You too.